This is the module you're going to be, one of the modules you'll be doing, and I'm going to help show you how to do the formula for Ohm's Law. So we're at Model Calculating Series and Parallel Circuits Basics. We're going to start the module. Here you see a series circuit. We have our volts coming from the battery, our total current or amperes and resistance. These two are in series seven and nine ohms. Now if you look over here, it says look at the circuit diagram, R1, seven ohms, R2, nine ohms, and the current, I, is 0.38 amperes. So use your calculator. You can do this simple equation here. Resistance times current. So 9 plus 7, since it's in series, 16 times 0.38 equals 6.0 volts. So we put in 6 volts, check, and you can see that's correct. Now I would like for you to do this bottom one here. These formulas will change on your screen, but this is just the basic form. Now, it's not in series anymore, we're in parallel. When you look at this circuit, we have our battery with one volt. Our current is 1.13 amperes. Resistance through here is one ohm and resistance through here is eight ohms. So the question here is look at the circuit diagram tells you all our information and it says to calculate total resistance. So some of you might think, well, we got to add these again. Well, no, you don't because they are not in series anymore. All right. So all we're going to do is volts divided by current so pop up your calculator again. So volts is one volt divided by current, which is 1.13, and that equals 0.88 resistance. You usually only have to put out the two decimal, uh, two spaces past the decimal point get the answer right. So here, this next problem, I'll let you guys do on your own as well. Again, up here, this might be a different formula, but follow the same process. 